Yeah, hi. Uh, was there any point in, in, in you know, the first couple of minutes uh, that you felt you, you, you might be in trouble or, or you, know, you were a bit worried? Was there any point at all? <laughs> I mean, <laughs> of course, if you watch the fight, probably the second kick got me a bit worried or whatnot. But, um, you know, that happens. You get caught. And um, I got caught and, you know, I fought through it, gave my composure back, game face back on and um, got me a takedown and uh, locked up a, uh, was going for a Kimura, but locked up a straight on bar, so. Yeah, I wanted to ask you that because it looked like you were going for Kimura, but ended up with a straight on bar. Did you, at that point, decide on the fly that, you know, you wanted to go for that submission? How did that come about? Well, um, funny thing, earlier this week, I was rolling with my trainer, Eric, and um, when I was trying to, I think I was going for Kimura, he told me I wasn't going to get it. And then he turned into a straight arm bar. And I was fighting to get it. And the whole time when I uh, locked up the straight arm bar on Tyson, I was like, I was thinking my trainer was telling me, you're not going to finish it. You're not going to finish it. And I'm like, okay, I'm going to finish this. And he happened to tap. Currently ranked seventh in the world. You just beat one of the most promising prospects in the division. How do you like your trajectory right now in your career? Um, feels good. You know, I had my last fight I had a loss, you know, and um, to just come off this loss definitely feels good. Um, but, you know, I'm, you know, rankings don't mean anything to me. I don't, I don't get paid because I'm ranked. I get paid because I fight. And this is part of the reason I'm one of the, I'm not one, but probably the active 205 pounder right now. Ovens, over here. Uh, over here. Ovens, here. Okay. Over the media day, you have shared to me um, about your, your status as the most active fighter in the 205 division. I'm not, I, I'll not ask you who's next. When is next? Um, you know, uh, I don't know. Knowing me, I, you, you got to understand. Knowing me, next can be two weeks from now. So I took fights on two weeks notice. Next can be, you know, three, four months from now, but uh, sooner than later. So congratulations on the big win. You're right now in Singapore, do you plan to stay on? And uh, how will you be celebrating this victory? Um, you know, you got my, you know, I got my team over here, so I'm gonna be celebrating with them. So, uh, <laughs> so yeah, uh, we'll be we'll be here in Singapore for a little bit. Probably shoot over to Thailand. Uh, Owens. Uh, Given the fact that in the light heavyweight division at this point, or even the modern light heavyweight division history, you have 11 wins, which is, I think, joint top five. So do you, get, do you think you get enough credit for what you do inside the octagon? Um, you know, at times, I think I don't. But, you know, it's neither here nor there. It's just, you know, you just got different people want to see different things. I'm a different type of fighter, just period. And... Um, you know, I, th 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 there's some fights that I have that I learn from. There's some fights that I have that I, I you know, that I'm, I want to take back. But at the end of the day, just, that's why I'm the active 205. I'm the, uh, that's why I'm the most active fighter in the 205 division. And I'm not fighting once a year, once every two years. You know, every time you catch me, I am pretty much have anywhere from four to five fights a year. So. And a lot of people are thinking that you have to face Jimmy Manuva again. Is that a fight that you'd be interested in? Hell yeah. I can't wait.